Hey everyone, how are you doing? It's your girl Twin D and I'm here to do a little mini read for you guys just to see what's going on and also based off of that channeling I had this morning where we heard that the masculines they're breaking their chains and they're moving away from the attachments and everything that has been holding them down. So I'm going to do this mini read just to find out what's what's going to be their outcome, what's going to what's happening with them. So let's see what's going on, guys. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power and the glory forever and ever. Amen. Okay. Oh my Lord. I don't even have all the cards. <laughs> I'm using the Chakra Wisdom Tarot. Okay, what can you tell me that's happening with these masculines, please? What's happening with these masculines, please? The Ace of Coins. This is a brand new beginning. Looking forward to just uplifting themselves and saying, I am free looking forward to that sun that sun energy that victory energy being happy being abundant being prosperous what else can you tell me please the fool i told you this is a brand new beginning they're wanting to take that leap of faith releasing all the attachments releasing anything that wasn't serving them releasing their tradition releasing their past releasing karmics releasing whatever you want to call it all those things that did not serve them any good purpose what else please you want to tell me all those things that were tying them down they're releasing they are releasing those energies Princess of Swords. This is the Page of Swords in the regular Tarot deck. So these masculines are definitely opening up their heart, letting the truth, allowing the truth to, to, to flow, breaking that ice from their heart, looking forward to a brand new future, to victory. To cutting off anything again cutting out anything that no longer serves them and the magician looking forward to their happiness creating their happiness creating their happiness now they're feeling strong within themselves now they're having a sense of self-worth appreciating themselves and that is what is allowing them to make that right decision to take that leap of faith there, there they're going there they're going towards their leap of faith as you say that's where they're going towards their leap of faith towards victory towards happiness towards success towards that sun and they're feeling good about it because they're going to create this happiness no matter what it takes they're creating this happiness the hanged woman which is the hanged man in the regular tarot see they're connecting to God seeking God's guidance praying asking for help trying to find that self-worth that they lack wanting to communicate but they cannot wanting to get up and move forward towards their future but they cannot because they have not found that truth as yet but they know that that truth is out there and they're heading towards their truth they're heading towards their truth 
and they're releasing any negative energy that was around them. The hanged man is also about release, letting go, moving forward. Let's clarify this and see what else we can get from, from what these masculines have to say. Tell me more about this Ace of Coin and what is this brand new beginning. See, in the past they could not, they could not see what was happening to them, what was happening around them. They could not see it. 555 five, five, that's a big change that's coming this is the king of wands in the reverse them not seeing the big picture them not appreciating themselves them not looking at who they truly are as a person they weren't even loyal to themselves not even to them to their own self they weren't loyal to see they were just in a place of heartbreak in the past a place of heartbreak until they started to seek advice from God and God came in and intervened. Because when they started to pray to God and say, God, help me to make this decision. Tell me what to do. God said, okay, you need my help, buddy. Now it's time for me to help you. I was waiting on you for so long to call on my name. And I'm happy you did because I am at your service. <laughs> Tell me about this fool. And this brand new beginning. This is the queen of pentacles. Oh, the queen of swords. What am I saying? The queen of swords. Them not, be able to, not being able to see the truth. Not being able to see the truth in the past. They were cold in the past. They weren't trusting their heart in the past. They had bitterness in the past because of situations that happened to them in other relationships, other connections. And again, because they seek God guidance, now they're gaining the courage that they need with the Queen of Wands to move forward to their destiny. Taking that leap of faith that God is guiding them to take. Tell me about this princess of swords, please. Oh, yes. Guiding them to take the action towards their empress. Cutting off what no longer serves them and moving towards their empress. To bring forth something new. To bring forth happiness. Children. A family. Prosperity. Love. Opening up their heart. Receiving this love giving this love, expressing their emotions, communicating to the Divine Feminine. And here, that's why they're keeping an eye on you. The Princess of Swords, Page of Swords, keeping an eye on you, making sure that they're doing all that it takes for them to move forward to you about this magician please the hermit going within trying to find that one spark that one thing that will help them to feel good within themselves trying to be brave trying to put their best foot forward and they're gonna do it we have Three major arcanas here. This is a big deal. They're going to do it. Because they're finding themselves. They were lost. They're finding themselves. And it's time to create this brand new beginning, this future with the Divine Feminine. Here they are following their intuition. And it's a black and white. I got to say it. It's my yin yang twin flame card, baby. There you go. And we have a three and a two. One, two, three on the board. 
the ace, the fool, this number two, and then the empress number three. One, two, three, baby, let's go. It's time for a brand new beginning. Time for a brand new beginning. Look as I split, as I split the deck. The six of cups, they, they, can't, they can't get their mind off of you. They can't get their mind off of you. And look, the, a brand new beginning. That's the brand new beginning that they're thinking about with you. That's the brand new beginning that they're thinking about with you. Can't get their minds off you. They cannot. Let's see what the Roman angels have to say about this connection and this message, please. So you're getting to know each other. So expect some communication. Getting to know the real you, the, your real selves. As you reveal your innermost selves to each other, your bond deepens. Because that, that's what they want to do. Reveal their self to you. The Empress, she's naked. They want to reveal themselves to you. But they got to first find themselves. And that's what they're working on. Finding themselves. I heard I was once lost, but now I'm found. <laughs> one, one, one. Make the effort. Great love is worth taking the steps you're guided to take. And that's why we got the High Priestess card. Because they're definitely going to be following their intuition. Leading them back to you. Here they are freeing themselves. Just like we we're saying. They got to find themselves. Then they're going to free themselves in order to move forward. It's time to take back control of your life. So they can have this brand new beginning. This situation involves marriage this is a brand new beginning that they want and they're heading there they're coming cutting those th those ties feeling good within themselves knowing who they are and moving forward towards the divine feminine let's get you a message from the angels the archangels let's see what they have to say archangels oh that was fast. Holy. Career transition and victory. Career transition. Archangel Shamuel, your life purpose is triggering a blessed career change. Maybe some of these masculines didn't even like the job that they were in. But they were staying in, in the job because just to make sure that they could satisfy whomever they are in the job for. They're going to be doing things that they love. That's even the Divine Feminine too, doing what they love. Yeah, <laughs> I don't mind. And then, <laughs> victory, 12.13 on my timer. Archangel Sandalfon, your prayers have been heard and answered. Have faith. Have faith. Your prayers have been heard and answered. Divine Feminines. A message for them personally, please. Oh. Freedom! Freedom! I told you these masculines are free. Freedom! Live wild and free. Choose your freedom. Claim your independence. I told you, these masculines are free. They are free and ready for that brand new adventure ready for that brand new adventure divine feminines this has been your reading your masculines are free and ready for that victory with their empress take care of yourselves everyone love you all bye